what's up guys welcome back once again it is me Mo we are back with some more plunder pirates guys I love this game I love it we've got four builders available a whole lot of loot you can see that our grog is absolutely full right now so what are we gonna do with it we're gonna go research one of our favorite troops guys the juggernaut I use the juggernaut in every single attack it's so powerful and we're about to go give it five more damage so it's gonna be even more powerful once it's done training up um, which is gonna be ugh, in six days so we're gonna have to deal with that long wait time but it's okay because the juggernauts are going to be ridiculous but uh, we do have a lot of gold as you can see we ha almost have three million five hundred thousand we need three million four hundred thousand to upgrade a mystic mortar so we're gonna go try and get that much gold for you guys so that we can upgrade a mystic mortar because that'll be awesome so we're gonna go ahead and search and blah 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 here we have it here's the base that we're gonna be attacking guys 381 thousand gold on this thing and 212 thousand grog that is not bad at all i'm loving that i also have an epic replay for you guys in a little bit with some gnarly loot on it so i know that y'all are going to be excited for that we're going to go ahead and do what we always do guys we drop down our juggernauts in the front of the line uh followed up by our gunners and then uh by shin shy as she comes in and she's going to go absolutely do some work and we're going to drop off our uh, witch doctors behind them so that they can heal and, and keep up the um, keep up the gunners for us We're gonna use all their abilities for those of you who've never played this game before guys Troops have abilities in this which is really cool because you get to control them You can see I just activated the witch doctors ability and he barely missed that huge herd of dead gunners But he actually raises things to life as you upgrade him uh, and his ability so that's really really cool the gunners They just get enraged shoot faster move faster do more damage all this kind of stuff uh, and then Shin Shai calls people in to focus on um, a certain uh, defensive building. So all of them have abilities, which makes this game cool. I mean, it adds another aspect of strategy to it that other games like this don't. So that's one reason why I really like it. You can see I'm going to go ahead and pop the gunner's ability right there. Again, you can see they're flashing purple. They're doing work, guys. We are going through this base. What is that, 400 loot left or something? Come on can't mess with me so we just raised a whole bunch more of our dead troops back to life with the witch doctor and they're actually pretty powerful so uh, a lot of times I'll use troops that are a little weaker like gunners uh, and wait for them to get wrecked by the mortars and then just bring them back to life because it makes it so much better for you um, it gives you practically double troops if you can bring a, a, a big amount of them back to life but sometimes you miss it it doesn't go as well um, as you would hope it would but we're just going to keep working our way around this base. I'm just going to use, I'm going to wait for uh, my witch doctor who's over here dancing with this gunner. I'm going to wait for him to work his way in uh, and see if he can do it. Oh, he, he barely was out of range of that one skeleton in the middle of the base. Uh, we still have him selected. It doesn't really matter. We're just going to go ahead and take out the base right here, guys, with total destruction. 100% right there. Now we have enough loot to go back and upgrade our mystic mortar which i'm super super stoked about so we're gonna head on back and uh why don't we go ahead and click on this mystic mortar see that we can upgrade it it is going to be a beast oh my goodness never mind we're not <laughs> so sadly guys i am the wrong pirate hall level i have to be pirate hall level seven i tricked you guys you thought we were upgrading it and we're not so we have to upgrade a whole bunch of other stuff before we move up to pirate hall seven because i want to make sure that i'm maxed out uh, there aren't really loot penalties or anything in uh, Plunder Pirates, which is cool. Uh, so that makes it a lot, I don't know, easier to jump into the game. You don't have to deal with loot penalties. You can upgrade and everything. But obviously, it always is best to upgrade your base as much as you can before you go up to the next one. Because otherwise, you're just behind with everything. So now we need to find some stuff to upgrade. All of our gunner towers or all of our gun towers can be upgraded. So we're going to go ahead and upgrade this one right here for 800,000. Then we've got a couple other ones. This one's level 6. So this one's already one level behind the other ones. Upgrade that bad boy. Head right on over here to this other one uh, that's in the corner. Upgrade that as well. So all of these are going to take about three days total. Um, the lower level one's only going to take one day. And then let's go ahead and see if we can find something else for us to upgrade with all this gold since we do have one more builder available um we can't upgrade our lighthouse we can't upgrade our pirate catcher i think we're just gonna go ahead and end up upgrading this grog storage right here so that we can hold a little bit more um and yeah so that's pretty much it for the upgrades as you guys can see but now look at this attack i'm going to show you Six hundred twenty-five thousand gold 700,000 grog that is ridiculous guys that's almost 
1.4 million in resources coming at you with an epic attack strategy you can see this awesome cinematic view guys that you can replay videos in one of my favorite parts of the game without a doubt easily one of my favorite parts of the game it makes it so interesting and cool look at them they're just walking around then you can press it again zoom out get a bird's eye view of the attack so we're coming in uh, from this side of the base working our way in he does have double walls which makes it kind of hard to get into but Shinshai is up there completely wrecking the wall the wall is trying to get in there to those defenses as are our juggernauts uh, and we've got all of our gunners up in here doing work we are heading into the base there goes some huge mortar blasts and they're going to take out a lot of our gunners but we have our witch doctors that are ready to raise some of them to life so that's one of the best things about bringing witch doctors with you they are a little squishy so they do die quickly but um they help you bring somebody back to life look at these look at these juggernauts right here they're just dancing around we're right in their face with this cannon they take it out so epic love this cinematic view um but yeah guys if y'all haven't tried the game out it's down below in the description it's going to be out for android very very soon in the next couple months so i'm super super stoked for that they are tweaking it and making it perfect for you guys so that it'll run just as smooth on Android as it does on iOS. So definitely make sure that you guys click on that link if you are on iOS, download that there. And then once Android comes out, guys, I will let y'all know when it launches. But you can see that we are still working our way around this base. We're working our way over to those gold mines to take the rest of it out. But that's pretty much it for this episode, guys. Uh, I'd really appreciate it if you guys like this, to like the video, show other people that there are other games out there besides Clash, that there are multiple uh, games that can be fun. The 3D aspect of this and rotating around it is unbelievable. It is so much better than other games where you can't rotate around your map and see what you're attacking. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, make sure you guys leave a like down below for me. Uh, comment as well. I'll do my best to reply to you guys. And uh, as always, make sure you keep calm and you plunder on, all right? I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.